Hey, welcome to Snowbound. This is a sneak peek on Halo. This is one of the maps that everybody plays. Um, one thing I should point out, that this game is awesome. When you're playing Snowbound, you never want to go that way. In the tunnels. You always want to stay on top of the, the upper part of the levels. Right here, this is where everybody dies. I might die because I'm trying to get an achievement, but if I get it, I get it. If I don't, I don't. Um, I haven't got it yet, but they say it's in a ranked match. You take a mongoose and you just run one person over with it. And you get the achievement. Simple as that. It says in rank match. I'm looking for someone to run over. Let's see if we can find somebody. And if it's that easy, you just need to drive around and run somebody. You just need to run somebody over. That's it. It's that easy. God dang it. Why? Oh. Did I run him over? No, I didn't. See, that's the cool thing. You, you have to do this for hours just to get it right. And then when you, once you get it right, then it's, see I went downstairs and I got, I died. I didn't listen to my own advice, which is never do that. But I will tell you, if you know what you're doing, and, oh. And you stay with the group and help your team out, then you'll do fine. Snowbound is the one level that everybody loves to hide and never has a game plan on it. I've won one match one time because I didn't because I didn't um, rush in. And we won the game, and it, the red team left because it was so many points. It was like 49 to 5 or something like that. If you have a game plan and you know what your game plan is, then you will survive. But if you rush in like I just did then there's a chance you could lose the whole game. But the chances of that happening are real slim. Everybody knows that. Right now it's 30, 33 to 29. And all I'm trying to do is run over one person on the red team. That's it. And it's not easy task because when you're doing it in a Team Slayer, apparently it's a lot more difficult. There's only two ways to get it. Lone Wolf or Team Slayer. And look at all that carnage. That could have been prevented by... By just not doing that. But by not going. Ah. I'm going. Ah! Obviously, I can't get one person to run over. I, I'm pretty lame. <laughs> That's pretty lame if I can't run over one person, you know? And I, I, 
I tried it in Lone Wolf. It's a lot harder because everybody doesn't want you to do it. And they'll purposely... Um, oh, almost a triple kill. I almost had you guys. 59 to 45 right now. Look at all this carnage. And we won. There's another perfect example. When you don't... When you don't rush in, you have a better chance of actually staying alive. Now... I suggest you get a mic. I suggest you... Definitely talk to your team. Make sure you're doing good teamwork. It, that's the crucial of uh, the difference between playing rushing in and winning by 50 points while the other team has 5. So if you really want to play and you want to play without rushing in, send me a message. If you have Halo 3, I'll jump in and we'll do it together as a team. So, enjoy the game.